being consistent on social media is a problem for your restaurant, stay tuned because I'm going to show you how you can create weeks, if not months worth of content in as little as an hour. And if we haven't met yet, I'm Gannon. I'm a partner at Run With It, and we are a marketing team dedicated to helping restaurants, bars, and breweries grow their business online. So if that's something you're into, hit the subscribe button and turn on post notifications because we are dropping our best tips every single week. One of the biggest problems that we're hearing from restaurants is that staying consistent on social media is very hard because the owners are trying to run the restaurant and sometimes they might not have a dedicated staff member taking care of the social media posts. At the end of the day, you're running a restaurant, so it might be the last thing on your mind that you need to get something out on social media about any promotions or events that you have coming up. A very good rule of thumb for your restaurant is to be posting at least four to five times per week on social media. And that means Facebook and Instagram and whatever other platforms that your business is using. But it's obviously very hard to do that because you're running a business and you have other things to focus on. Luckily, there's an extremely efficient way to start pumping out content and get it scheduled for the future. And this is the exact strategy that we use for our clients to help them get the word out about new promotions, drive traffic to their site so they're increasing online ordering and getting more reservations. So let's jump in and we'll show you exactly how we're using Canva to help make content creation a whole lot easier for your business. So hop right into Canva and you'll see a dashboard like this. And what you want to do is go to where it says Instagram post right here and click on that. And you'll see a blank template, but what you can actually do is search keywords at the top left and it will load templates related to that keyword. So in this example, we'll use cocktails, but you can use burgers, pizza, smoothies, anything. And I'll show you that pizza will pop up like this and change the text and everything right here. Go to smoothies, smoothie posts, and we can try burgers, burgers, and you've got posts like this. So tons of templates to use. You can honestly never run out of content. Um, and then you can use their pictures or you can use the pictures that you have taken. So for this video, like I said, we're going to use the cocktail menu as a promotion we're going to type in cocktails and then we can just pick through these templates honestly and just see which ones stand out to us so i like this one right here and i have already uploaded pictures of some cocktails that i took at a recent photo shoot you can take pictures of your own like i said or use theirs in the description for this video we actually have a free pdf guide showing you how we take photos like this and we edit them Literally step by step, what are the best tips that you can do to get photos like this on your own? Totally free, just hit the link in the description and it'll be there for you. I would like to use this photo for the cocktail post. So I'm going to literally just upload it through the upload media. And I already have these pre-uploaded, so I'm just gonna use this. I click on this picture and I just drag it onto this picture and it's already pretty much cropped and edited the way I want it to be so and you can change the colors too you know I don't really like this orange for the drink doesn't really match the drink you could do it that way um, there are already photo colors that are matching the picture that you uploaded so all you got to do is that and yeah it's it's super simple so you can animate it right here check out these animations breathe block rise baseline and you can download it at the top right it's a video save it for mp4 if we don't want to animate it i usually save it as a png just so it's the high quality download it and all you gotta do is just save it to your desktop and that's pretty much it you can do this with as many cocktails as you're releasing it doesn't have to be limited to one and the good news is you have so many different templates that you can pick from so you will literally never run out of content and if you don't have your own pictures, like I said, you can use theirs. This is a good template. So we can just repeat the process. Again, we have all of these photos uploaded. Uh, that one looks pretty cool right there. You can obviously edit all these words. Same thing. We can animate here. Pop looks pretty cool. Download. Again, you'll have it right here. 
What we can also do is resize this post and turn it into a Instagram story. So it'll be 1080 by 1920. Copy and resize. And now it is in the aspect ratio of an Instagram story post. And Instagram stories are better for animation. So I'm gonna go ahead and use, I like breathe, I can use breathe. And it's animated, you know, just download MP4 and download and it's there. Like it's all you have to do. And once you've got all the pictures taken, once you've got everything going, um, you can just upload them to Canva and just pump out as much content as possible without having to go start from scratch every single day and make it a pain in the ass. Let that walkthrough be an example as to how much content you could actually make using Canva because we made a post and an Instagram story in two minutes. And going back to the rule of thumb from before, you should be posting four to five times per week on social media. So if we can make one post in two minutes, you should be able to make a week worth of posts, a week's worth of posts in about 10 minutes. And doing some quick math, you should be able to make about a month's worth of posts in less than an hour. So if you're using Canva, you really have no excuse to be posting on Instagram and Facebook, you know, four to five times a week. And that is the exact strategy that we use to post every single day for our clients. For us, we have a mountain of content and photos that we've already taken for them. But, you know, we can also use photos that they've taken and uploaded to a cloud for us to use. And we just pump out content like it's absolutely nothing. I should also mention in the previous video, we walk you through how we schedule posts using Facebook Business Suite and keeping everything pretty much hands off. So you can sit down on Sunday night, use that content you made in Canva and schedule it throughout the week. So you don't have to open up Instagram or Facebook every single day and have to manually go in and upload those photos. So that'll do it for this video. If you enjoyed and you want more tips, please hit the subscribe button below, drop a thumbs up and leave a comment telling us what you want to see in the future. If you have any specific questions, connect with our team on social media. Those links will also be down below and we will see you in the next video.